What's good, y'all? Lil Wayne just opened up about being passed over for the Super Bowl halftime show in his own hometown, New Orleans, and he says it hurts deep. He hopped on Instagram, thanking fans and homies for their support, but admitted the snub cut deep. Wayne said, that hurt. It hurt a whole lot. The Super Bowl, the biggest stage in the world, was held in New Orleans, Wayne City. But instead of giving the hometown legend a spotlight, the NFL chose Kendrick Lamar. You know it's only one opportunity to win a championship. No round twos. While we respect Kendrick, many expected Wayne to represent Noya on that stage. Wayne had his hopes up, thinking he'd secure the gig. But the disappointment hit different. He admitted he wasn't mentally ready for the letdown and blamed himself for assuming he had it locked in. First of all, I want to say forgive me for uh, forgive me for the delay, um, the delay on and just the delay. I want to say uh, at the first of all, I had to get strength, I had to get strength enough to do this without breaking. Um, I must say thank you. I must say thank you to every voice, every opinion, all the care, all the love, and the support out there. It's, your, your words turn into to homes and they held me up when, when I try to fall back. Um, that hurt. Hurt a lot. You know what I'm talking about? It hurt a whole lot. Um, I blame myself for not being mentally prepared for a letdown. automatically mentally putting myself in that position like somebody told me that was my position. So I blame myself for that, but I thought that was nothing, you know, I thought that was nothing better than that, that, that spot, and that stage, and that platform in my city. You know, so it hurt. It hurt a whole lot. Um, but y'all, y'all up. Fucking amazing. It made me feel like shit not getting this this opportunity. And when I felt like shit, you guys reminded me that I ain't shit without y'all. Hip hop heavyweights like Birdman, Juvenile, Master P, Boosie Badass, and especially Nicki Minaj have all voiced their support for Wayne. Nicki even took direct shots at Jay-Z, accusing him of blocking Wayne over personal beef. As for Wayne, he's focused on working on himself, feeling the love from the culture. But is this just hip-hop politics or something bigger? Let us know in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to Hip Hop Headlines Haven for more real news. Stay tuned for the next headline. Peace.